Well, hi everybody, this is Dan on the cell, and I am busy mixing up paint. Why? I'm gonna show you. <laughs> For some reason, I have always wanted to paint an umbrella, so I know it's going to make a big mess, but I love making a mess. Yay! It's now a quarter to five. <laughs> you know I said I was going to make a mess? <sighs> there is disaster everywhere. And I learned a lot. What can I say? I think it'll be interesting when it dries, and as a first experiment, the reality is it'll probably take me twice as long to tidy up the mess I made, but I knew that, so I'm going to start right away before it dries too much. Well, I'm pretty glad to have got that purple off there. A few more bits on there that I haven't tried yet, but I thought I'd show you, after all these years of cleaning and uh, painting with acrylic, how I clean my floors. These are my acrylic painting shoes. I'll put those out of the way. I have a little scrubby thing. Where's it gone? Here it is. And all I do is I just scrub with my foot like this. And then I will take with my foot again a wet cloth. And that will take most of it off, as you can see. Let's have a go at this bit here. It looks like it's inside the crack here. Ah, let me show you what I do when it's inside the crack. <coughs> I have somewhere here an old red, a credit card type thing. And all I do is I just... And I'll try and get that so you can see it. <laughs> it's very difficult to do both things at the same time. But I literally just go like this and get it most of it out of the cracks. And then I found out I got some of the paint on my duvet. Now, I am going to try something out that I learned today to see if it works. And if it does, I will share it with you. So here it is before. And here it is after. Apparently, and I didn't know this, that acrylic paint will come out of material as long as it hasn't been near any heat. So, look at that. <laughs> and the door. I'm a very messy painter, aren't I? <laughs>